Hey everybody, what's up, Jump here, and welcome back to another video. Today, I wanted to show you really quickly how to unlock themes for Wallpaper Engine. So you'll see at the top of the screen, for example, I have a space-themed Wallpaper Engine, and if I go to my Wallpaper Engine settings here, I can go to the General tab and change to all these other types of themes. For example, there's a Halloween theme, and a rose theme, and all these other different types of themes that just look really nice. The metal theme looks really nice. Um, and you could change these freely whenever you want as soon as you go ahead and go through with the instructions in this video. This is actually built into Wallpaper Engine, but for whatever reason, it is not enabled by default. So this will also go ahead and unlock you an achievement, I believe, called the Konami Achievement. Anyways, in order to go ahead and do this, you want to go to the settings in the top right and go to the About section. Then, as you'll see here in just a moment, I'm going to go ahead and show you my keyboard, and we'll enter a special keystroke on it. So to do this, just input up arrow, up arrow, down arrow, down arrow, left, right, left, right, B, A, and then enter. And what you'll see is Wallpaper Engine will spin here and unlock the skins for you. Now it is fairly easy to mess this up just based off of the fact that you're inputting a bunch of things at once. And if you do one miss input, it actually won't work. But one thing to keep in mind is that when you press the arrow keys, it'll actually go ahead and move the Wallpaper Engine settings menu for each thing that you do. So pressing up should move it upwards if it's done properly. Pressing down should move it downwards if it's done properly. And so if it stops working midway through, that's why it wouldn't be working. Now I'll actually show you up on screen right now what the set of keys is just so that you are able to look at it visually in case you missed it before. Go ahead and pause, try it out for yourself. Anyway, something I think I forgot to mention is that if it doesn't work, if this code doesn't work, you can try using the enter on your number pad instead of your main keyboard. So of course I'm showing the main part of the keyboard right now on screen, but if you go to the very right of your keyboard, you may have an extra set of numbers and period and zero and plus all that, go ahead and press the enter key there instead of the enter key on your main keyboard if, for whatever reason, most of the code is working but not the very end. Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you want to see more tutorials on Wallpaper Engine, please let me know. I can do some very basic tutorials on how to create basic wallpapers and add clocks and all that. And if you want some tutorials on how to use Discord, I have a bunch of those, including how to, for example, use bold, underline, italic, strike through. Um, and even blank lines in Discord. So if you want to check that out, it'll be on screen right now, and I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.